Welcome back. So, just doing a little unit farming. So this one's going to be relatively short. It's, uh, nothing too exciting. Um, had a little spare time with the, uh, Paragon Daily. Not the Daily, the 4-Hour Crystals. I've been getting some extra energy refills besides all the bonus ones we've had recently. So that's what the mission is right now to start catching back up on these units. I was down to 33, about the 100. Uh, it's not a lot, but it's definitely heading the right way. So I was thinking about it. And about uh, let's see, we got this week and next week before the big sales uh, it's definitely guaranteed you do all your units you're gonna have a good time but better stuff no matter what progression you are um if you're close to a progression now's the time to push for it uh the lower ones if you grind like say you grind arena or gold and iso you could depending on uh, if you push you have all your uh, extra catalyst saved up. You could make the next progression in two weeks. That's if if you really want to. With rank up champions, it it'd be a hard push, but theoretically you could at least do. I think up to Cavalier one progression within two weeks. The Thronebreaker one's a little bit harder because I want to say I, we could look here in a second but I want to say it's like five, four or five champs at rank four. You want to bypass doing the story content. But that one's a little bit harder if you're not like see your beginning cow. It'd be a really hard to push, but it is doable in two weeks. As long as uh you got a bunch of battleships saved up by all the catalysts you need in Battleground currency. Get a bunch of catalysts. So, yeah, it's not the biggest amount of units, but like I said, it's heading in the right way. And you no, know, I don't have immediate plans for the stony. another one down so I finished polar opposite one that took a while I'm stupid got to do this one waning moon and then you just saw this Ooh, single clear I should 
do that for the gold. And the shards. Wait, what? what is this one again? Uh, that's not... When these came out, the rewards were awesome. Now that some time's passed and we have some stars, they don't seem as cool, but if you're trying to make a push, if you can make it through this, it'll be good stuff. So I got that. Like that. But yeah, so this two energy refills. Get another classic initial clear down. Same here. Okay, so six energy refills in about another hour. I farm a decent amount of shards and probably another sixty units. So that's what I'm doing at the moment. Because it is late Sunday. And I'm not the biggest fan of these arenas. Although Couple milestones in this one, I guess. But still, it's... there's no battleships. That's what sucks. This one, you at least get shards or PCH, so you can get ISO after opening crystals and selling it. But yeah, it's like I said, it's, it's not a big deal. But... You know, slowly getting at it so I can get some extra ISO and units and I'm gonna the reason why I mentioned the holiday sales if like I said if you wanted to you could make a push for it you go to the store obviously since I went to story mode route I didn't have to worry about ranking up the champs. Plus, I was already uh, Thronebreaker when they released that. But it's good for new new players. But if you still haven't spent this currency, depending on where you are, you could uh, get some of these catalysts. And the Alliance. You've been doing AQ. So there's a chance. But, yeah. I'm gonna maybe spend a thousand units, depending on whatever the deal is for Paragon, but I'm going to go for every unit for uh the banquet and then the ten here there's twenty more coming so oh I might have to buy one I have to buy a five dollar deal. Unless I can get that incursion. Go back and grab one more in there. It's another spot.
get to zone six. I can get one more. Right. I gotta see who I'd rank up first. That was hard. Just getting the fifth one. So, what's my... Where I'm currently at kind of overview. And yeah, I'm gonna throw everything at the banquet I can. And uh, I usually save uh, 30 for um, holiday sales. Um, depending on how sales, whatever's in the sales. They said maybe a thousand units, if that. Or, um, maybe five or ten bucks on whatever the lowest unit thing is. Um, depending on how they, the deals roll out. But I think I will... And I'm gonna wait till next till the sales start before I decide. I might come down here to I just do this five dollar one because that's always a good one. If I get it, if I don't like the sales or the holiday sales, I just buy that first thing. Depending when they start the sales, Thursday morning or Friday. Uh, yeah, that way, hopefully. And how long I'd have to go I don't have the dates memorized uh, on the banquet event this year um, then I could hit it again at least get two of the five dollar deals daily cards and then that would help out oh That's not bad at all. It drops out to the basic. For a selector. That might be the way to go. Next week, uh, like I said, I can see the deals, but next week, do Sunday, Sunday, Sunday special, and the $5, because that's still under 30 bucks, and that gets me a bunch of, bunch of units, a couple paragons to open, well, one, you never know. Um, so, yeah. See you in the next video. Sorry for rambling so long. Thanks for watching.